You see how ugly that thing is? It'll cut you too, boy. You go to pill and suck your out and slip. <laughs> it's like, wow, it's ugly on the outside here. But inside. The good is in the inside. Y'all got on? On the orange, the orange pillar, the pillar, the other pillar, you have to peel it back. Have to get your fingers all orange smelling. Look at you. Like the apple, you got to peel it back. Don't you see God creating shit? You got to peel it back. You can't look on the outside. You got to know what's on the inside. You got to speak what you want. You got to believe what you want because on the outside will deceive you. See, you think that's trouble, but it's a change in your life that's been the curve to make you a better man, a better woman, a better person. But you look at it like you look at trouble, so you're distressed and you you hurt, but you don't know the best in your life is about to occur. If you understood God. But if you name it that, God, you know what I'm saying? And now you got everything to do with your mindset. Things ain't what they say. And when you begin to see through God's eyes and know what you lost, say glory to God. Say hallelujah to Jesus. Go to uh, 2 Corinthians 5. I'm, this is what we're already into it, so we're just going to get you strict to go with it. 2 Corinthians 5 and 17. Let's go there. Say hallelujah. Because you got to know, say David. And this ain't about naming and claiming. It's not when you see trouble and God gives you the ability to to make because in your life you can call it whatever you want to call it. So I'm oh, see in the midst of the you say I'm blessed. So I'm blessed. Because I'm in the storm and they consume me. I'm blessed. And while the storm will have to cease. And everything in the tall storm to stop got come to me. Me change my mindset. Don't they change it? Don't they change it? They think that some people, some people just haunt me. Yeah. Ain't good. All I gotta do is stop by the police work down. I'm done. I'm out of the game. I'm a gangster until I get stopped. Oh my god, I talk all kinds of trap. Oh my god, I get stopped by the Yes, sir. No, sir, man, what's wrong with you, man? Look at him. You be quiet. Yes, sir. No, sir. He's 21. I'm 65. <laughs> hey, they change me. Hey, God, you. You change me. Something come to change you, but you look at this bad, but it come to change. It's time up. Your time up. Your time up. Your season up. Change your ways. Change your life. God telling you something. God showing you something. Change it. Stop it. Do something different. Ain't yes. hey, gonna do it. Yes. Oh, hallelujah. You're 21, 19. You got time to get married three more times. Yes. You can fall in love, get your heart broke by four more times. You still be alright. Right. Say hallelujah. Yes. You young. Ain't hey, gonna do it. Somebody 30 years from I'm hard broken. Don't worry about me. That's gonna be a love. Yes. And next one gonna come along. You'll be alright. Hey God, good. Yeah. Hey God, come on. I used to live in high school, sweetheart. Me and him been going together for three years. Child, shut up. Go on about your business. By the time you get in the car, you have about five of them. But <laughs> hey God, good. You got, and, and not, you're not guaranteed this time, so you got to know what to do with your time. Y'all, you're, you're not guaranteed the time. And that's the problem that people have. It don't matter your age. You ain't guaranteed it. So you gotta make good use of your time. You can't be wasting your time moping and groping and crying and whining when you got to redeem the time and make up the time you already lost. When you mess around with somebody, you're on a job you shouldn't have been. With somebody you shouldn't have been, you got time to be right there. I was hooded. Man, you better leave that home. Don't watch your business and bring the next one. Say next. <laughs> Don't worry. I always see that when we get, I always see the end of something is the beginning.
beginning of something new. Say glory to God. I got to bring a positive about my negative. Yeah. I lose a job, I say, something better is coming. Something better is coming. Because I serve a mighty Lord. The best is yet to come. The best is yet to come. The best is yet to come. No power will spill milk unless you're going to lick it up. And you know you ain't going to do that. My God, life too short. Too precious. Time too precious. How do you know it's too precious? All these things going on around you want to cry about spilled milk? I'm going to go buy me another car. Praise God. Ain't God good. Ain't no way that old Lord. Because time is precious. Say time is precious. I'm trying to get some. Say time is precious. You get the one thing you can't get back. You can get the repossessed car. You can get maybe the house back, but you can't get time back. Time go. Ain't no way going back to it. That one wants you about somebody trying to buy back to my high school. Say, girl, you better leave it alone. You've been married two times and you've been married five. You might want to leave him alone. Ain't God good. Because he done changed and you have too. He used to open the door, now he'll look at you like you're crazy if you tell him over Time will change. Time break to make a change. Say hallelujah, Jesus. And while you remember about what you had, baby, you ain't get that no more. Let's go. Y'all ain't saying that. I don't get so he used to not be like that child. She used to not be the man looking at that dog. Them people done got a couple of gray hands. And look, you ain't putting up with too much. Y'all ain't saying nothing. And if you ain't right, then you do. Hmm. Hey, God, good. They ain't trying to prove that they prove the days old. I didn't prove my love. Ain't that real now? Time ain't that a change. And you still using the old trick? Don't trick you using the work no more, child? Hey, God, good. You can buy all the gallons and all the half of you want. It don't work. <laughs> Y'all ain't said it to me. I know you look the same to me. No matter what kind of hat do you get. <laughs> I don't care if you told us green, white, blue, orange, psychedelic. It don't make me no difference. Say, I love Jesus. Ain't no time no pass all that good looking on that. Y'all got it. Time to change. Ain't time to change. Tell me you a little more girl. Bring your big butt on him. What you got? 
have to take advantage of your time and do something positive to change your life. Your life is not going to change. Time not change. Government change. If you think you're going to live off the system, baby, you better get something off your nose. By the time they get through fixing it up and giving away all your money, they give it out to the bottom of the pit. Kitty. And by the time they give that, the grocery store went up so high, come on, it's about hot dogs. The whole thing's cheap. <laughs> Praise God. I went and bought me some alone the other day. Praise God. Hey, hallelujah, Jesus. <laughs> Time changing. Yeah. Ain't got to do it. Chicken used to go in the grocery store and load up chicken, chicken, wait, chicken, neck, chicken, everything. Now you look at chicken and say, ooh, that's a commodity. That's, that's a commodity there. That's, ooh, them chicken, woo, Jesus. Them chicken wings, man, them chicken wings so high, y'all don't tell you. You be like, won't be no wings today. <laughs> stamps or no stamps. Ain't God good. <laughs> Say hallelujah, Jesus. Time done change. And when you realize time done change, that's why when I see young people sitting right now doing that, man, time ain't change, that ain't gonna work for you. What you seen in somebody else's life and how they act is not gonna work for you. So you ain't got no examples that you experience in your upbringing that's gonna work for you. You need to figure. You, oh, you need to see God and figure out for yourself. Oh my God, what's gonna work for you? Because this ain't gonna work sitting around doing nothing. Oh, glory to God! Did you see the pretty women in the way on their husband? They were pretty when they first were sitting. And the more they sit, they
Hey, God, good. And to the third. <laughs> y'all think I'm playing. <laughs> you said, what about the rat because it's big to her? And I'm gonna talk up, I'm gonna you know, talk you up so good. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk you up so good. It's gonna be healing tonight. You're gonna be delivered to the house. It's gonna be coming from somebody else. Cause that ain't gonna be him. Cause the spirit of healing is still in the house. The spirit of living is still in the house. And I'm just gonna blow it, slap up. That's the secret of being in the house. Hallelujah, glory to God. He's gonna go cha cha. I'm just gonna be him. I'm saying. Whoever got the mic, they gonna have a load on their shoulders. Cause the people gonna look at me, gonna prophesy. Times are changing, and you got to change. I tell you, the young people don't know you got to change. If you don't, if you don't, if you keep going by and, and, and marking your life like what happened to your parents, what happened in the past, it's a whole nother era now. Some things without godly guidance, without godly counseling. Grown up parents don't even know. That's how it's so changed so much. That's why you find a whole bunch that your parents don't understand you. It's not that they ain't been with you being. They know if you keep doing what you're doing, you ain't gonna get nothing because time doesn't change. Ain't God good. Praying God, you got three boys for oh, oh, Lord, that child's gonna take you out. Don't child's gonna take you out. Child's gonna take you out. That's a lot of spirit. But not mine, I ain't no Anyway, some people, child wouldn't take my dinner. Glory to God. That one tells us the woman leaving, you got child for ain't you? Ain't no use that child for you get all that money. <laughs> I said, he said, ain't God good. It's best to stay with you. What God put together, let no man put on asunder. Ain't that right? Ain't that what they say? Ain't that what the word say? What God put together, let no man put asunder. Ain't that what he say? Did y'all hear me? Did y'all hear me? Oh, uh, y'all ain't hear me. Well, God put together that no man put us up. Y'all ain't heard me. Y'all ain't heard me, did you? Y'all hear me? Y'all didn't hear me now. Break it down, break it down. Break it down, break it down. <laughs> if God don't put it together, if you don't know God put it together, We wait no 30, 20 years on my God to put together. It's too late to turn back now. <laughs> y'all with me? Say hallelujah. Ain't God good? Y'all with me? And you say, say, say God's good. God's gonna do some things in your life, but you gotta know that's why you got you can't go by your friends. You can't go, you need the Holy Ghost, you need the power, your direction. You can look at all that stuff that blows your head up, thinking it's easy, thinking it ain't hard work. Y'all ain't saying thing. Y'all ain't now. Everything should I can see that it was instant success. No, baby. That's all hard work. That ain't just standing on no computer looking at pictures. Man, that's putting your finger to the test. That's doing some things. That's studying, reading, getting some knowledge. Ain't got a little. Knowing in and out what you're doing because there's so many crooks out there. There's so many things going to get over take your idea. Y'all ain't saying that like, you living in a wicked world, man. You can't lie. Right? Somebody, somebody, you got a song. You got some things you gonna do. Hey, man, somebody take your stuff. Come on, man. Ain't got good. You don't know nothing about no patent or nothing. Ain't got good. Somebody, you want to? Let me get off point. Now nah, these days, if you do something, you gotta look at the ins and outs. You gotta dig down into it, research it. Even to get married, if you go with somebody, you gotta do some research. Pull up the jail law and everything. Credit report. Yeah. Give me your social security something. <laughs> See what kind of credit you got. Because I ain't been living beneath my means because I know I'm somebody. You know what I'm saying? I deserve the best. And I love you, but I can do without you. If you can't, because at the end, the love going to show by what you do. Say better. God can take you from down and bring you up. That's why it's got to be God led, because you can't go by none of that. Ain't God good? Because they can falsify all that. Amen. Oh, boy, you got to be God led. You can just look at somebody and say, they're going to be successful. No, you don't know that. I don't see a lot of successful people. 
Start out good, but end up bad. Jesus. Ain't God good? Yeah. I'll take it one sniff. I mean, one, one wrong place, one wrong time, one feet or two minutes. Black and mild. They take you for a mile. Ain't God good? I don't know why you have to retwist it. You have to re- How you gonna bow? Oh, let it really roll up black and mild. You got to retwist it. You got to add. You got to add a little something. I'm gonna have to teach y'all church people a little bit. When y'all be spelling something like black and mild, I think you need a little black and mild. It's mild, but it ain't that. <laughs>
Wasn't nothing but a piece of cake. Wasn't nothing but a piece of cake. It's just a piece of cake to you. I've been thinking about this thing for two days. <laughs> they don't get through. But they think it's nothing. So they sit around. Man, look at him. Oh, I'm going to get it out. Oh, I got that nice piece of cake sitting up there. Well, ain't but one little piece of that I know he must have said somebody rang I know he ate my cake. You be trying to talk yourself out of it. I know he ate my cake. I know this sucker. I just know he ate. You get mad now. Like you face him. I know this sucker ain't He walk, he all smile. Hey, man, what's up, dad? <laughs> You're like, what's up? No, you go to the kitchen. Pay this rent, it's like you're gonna pay out this house. 
All they want is my money. And every time I make something, they always ask me for something. Yeah, payback time. Ain't it real? Man, look here. I don't know what I'm doing today. Don't let your shirt know how that you, you owe them, they owe you. You say, give me $10. Yeah. Oh, what? What shirt sure is this? Say, Nine months I carried you. No job. I'm sick of putting down the sick, you're sick of what? Come back on E and think it's nothing wrong with it. They got it. No, you won't get it no more. You won't get my car no more. Ain't got good. Time to change. Ain't got good. And there's one thing, and let's move on, move on. There's one thing you gotta understand. Church, young people don't understand what parents go through. Because they ain't never been a parent. So a lot of things the parents go through, you're not compassionate with your parents. Because you don't know, like you talk about what you went through, imagine what they went through. Even dealing with you. No compassion for parents. And that really stuff. No compassion. Look, you know, 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 He's a Dunkin' Donut car. Ain't with ten dollars probably count. I know you like coffee, and I'll try to get you one every every two weeks or something. I get paid, I'll try to do a little something for you. Cause I really appreciate you, cause I know I was a handful. Yeah, keep in mind when these dogs don't show up. No compassion. But see what you gotta understand is, and I'm gonna move on. I'm gonna read on for real. You gonna read what you saw. That's why y'all see all these bad kids coming out. Ain't this a bad job? These days, you be going to snatch my child on. You be a Walmart, you say, I can get up out of here. Leave basket on. Let me get up out of here. I know that little boy that just said that to his mom. Shut up, mama. Shut up. I'm like, let me get up out of here. I ain't going to tell no story. Sometimes I'll be in my chill house. I said, let me get up out of here. <laughs> Chad, let me get the whole set of butter. I can't talk about it because of what I was talking about. And the lady is just having a change. It's a whole different, it's a different upbringing. It's a different way you got to bring it to you. You got to take knowledge. You got all this other stuff. And it's just different stuff you have to do. And you have to be on top of it. Now they need more attention. Now they ever did. But we so busy trying to get out. So, <laughs> ain't gonna do. And we don't understand it. The society we live in. And it don't matter where you come. It don't matter if you stay in a middle class home, a poor home, a, 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 well, a rich home. It don't matter. It's coming out of every home. So people ain't got that excuse about where I'm from. Because everything you said, because where you from, that guy that's standing in that match is going through the same thing. That little yeah. young man. Got mental problems, demon problems, drug problems, smoking at the age of 10. Why? Because it's in your society. Your society is corrupt. Yeah. So what that take more time? To admit of different things. Ain't gonna do. Say hallelujah to Jesus. Look at your next time change. And, and, and I want you to look, I want y'all I want y'all say this out loud and say, but look, got in the pastor right today. Is y'all in the house? Y'all making me do this. Y'all in the house. And, and because the Holy Spirit, He's always giving what you need to take more attention. Y'all on and begin to take make your time valuable. That's why I tell you, look, man, if they ain't bring you up, they bring you down. Stop trying to be balanced. If they ain't bring you up. Ain't nothing about somebody paying your rent, but can they help you buy you something greater in the future? That stable, that stable life ain't no good. It ain't gonna help you go up higher. If it ain't pushing you higher, if it ain't causing you to do better, 
That girlfriend ain't good for you. That boyfriend ain't good for you. If it ain't make you want to be successful and do more. I don't care how pretty or fine or handsome he is. I don't care if he got dressed off down to his butt. He ain't no good for your future. She ain't no good for your future. And it's something that you got to turn 35, 20, and, and to, to realize that you've been wasting your time because you have an advanced higher than you know you can live because of your choices. Hang on a minute. You look at something, but you should have looked at something else. You look at stability instead of looking at success. I don't just want to be stable. I want to be successful. Hey God, I don't just want some a partner. I want somebody to help me. To become. You ain't got you should gotta help me become. And I help you become. Become what? Whatever my dream is, whatever my vision is. Ain't God good. And if you're not helping me do that, then all that lovely lovely stuff is gonna keep us where we at. And after a while we're gonna get burned out. That's why people get burnt out. Because that stability stuff, getting unexcited. If you're not advancing, if you want to know why you're frustrated, because you're not advancing like you're supposed to. And, you, and you're frustrated. And you blame it on this and blame it on that, but the problem is that you're not advancing. And that's frustrating. Unconsciously, you are frustrated. So you have to figure out, you, you don't know why you're frustrated. So you try to figure out, so you pick something so you can say you're frustrated because it is. But the real true reason why you're frustrated, because you're not advancing. Because we are people that are supposed to advance. We don't supposed to stay in one condition. We are people that come from slavery. We are people that come from the body. And work our way up. We are people of advance. People fear us because we advance. It's in your blood. Amen. And when you when you're not getting that, you you gonna blame the man, you blame the woman, you blame the job, you blame that. But the true problem is that you're not advancing. You can have a job paying you good, just better than make it. You still ain't happy, and you still stuck. You missing something. Okay. That's something you missing is the blood of Jesus that you supposed to be advancing. I'm supposed to be over this. I'm supposed to be supervised by now. I'm supposed to be in the office by now. I'm supposed to have more by now. So by me not understanding, I got to pick out the thing that I think that is causing me to feel this way, but that's not it. I'm telling you what it is. You're not advancing as quick as you know you can. And what's in your life is holding you back. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, that's awesome, baby. I could have got it, but I... I don't know. I don't know right now. I might have to do the robot to get back up. Say hallelujah, Jesus. I'm just trying to share this. This life stuff, see, for is a true life thing. It's a spirit of God showing you life. Because when this is life, it's a spiritual life, but it's a life that you can't see, but it's things that God will reveal to you. And when you see these things, and it's funny, it's laughable, but it's true. And if you open your eyes and be able to see, and I'm going to give you the need the word of God, give you scripture to go wrong, with, because you got to stop being angry about stuff and begin to put yourself together so you can advance in life. You're not tired of the person. You're tired of not advancing. You're not tired of being broke. You're tired of not advancing. Because there ain't nothing being a broke as long as you're advancing. No, you can see where your money went. No, you can see what you're doing. Y'all ain't saying that. Ain't God good. So it ain't being broke. It's not seeing nothing. Show me where I waste to spend my time. Advancing. That's why you think it's thing thing when you get a car, you, you can look at your car. You say, well, I got a car. It makes you feel like you accomplished something. 
Y'en a un. Dans la gloire, on a un grand contre tout le monde. As long as you feel like you're advancing and moving forward, you can. But when you don't stay somewhere too long and not advance, you'll find a reason why not to be happy. But the true reason I'm telling you today is that you're not advancing like you're supposed to. Your time is not on. Ain't, ain't not good. And, and stuff, you got something that you stuck, that you're not, you stay with your bills get paid, and they say you don't know, got food, you got you know, the successes of life, but you're still in the same spot. It was good for a while, and after a while, this is what happened. You start finding something wrong with it, because there is something wrong with it, because you ain't advanced. So that's when your problems begin to come. You start picking, picking people out, picking things out. The reason why it's like this 